notebook one a notebook DIY I have a keychain and I have like something with washi tape and I also have a I'm I have to thank you guys so much I have 31 subscribers are you guys kidding me I never even thought I was gonna get 10 you guys are amazing I can't thank you guys I know what you want for back to school videos I am having some good ideas on the way so yeah so if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I already said leave requests below, and yeah, let's jump right in. Okay, so for the notebook, you're going to need a notebook, a dark paint, and a white, white paint, a plate, and a paintbrush. So first you want to take your dark paint, I'm using a dark blue, and you want to take your notebook and paint one third of your notebook that color. And do the top, not like, because you... That's what an ombre is. You do the top one-third of your notebook the dark blue color. And then you want to take your original dark blue color or dark color. You want to add a little bit of white. And you want to paint another third of your notebook and make sure it is under your dark blue color. And then what you want to do is take the original color again and add even more white than before. And then go ahead and paint it for the last one-third that color and then you want to do a couple coats but make sure you let it dry between each coat which I didn't so I kind of messed it up and once you're done with your coats then the notebook's done for the washi tape materials you're going to need washi tape and one of your school supplies so what you want to do is just decorate your school supplies with washi tape you can do any pattern you can do any design you can do anything with your note box thing and supplies but um what i'm doing here is i'm taking pieces of this purple washi tape that i got at target and i'm just doing the like edges i guess yeah and it came out really really cute in the end and it adds a little pizzazz to your supplies and if someone tries to take your thing you'll know which one's yours so it has all that awesome washi tape on <laughs> For the keychain, you're going to need peeler beads and a pegboard. So what you want to first do is go ahead and search up a cute little design on the interwebs. And I just found this really cute little pencil, so I decided to just go along with the pencil and yeah. <laughs> this is how it looked when it came out and it was really, really cute. So now what you want to do is take some um, wire, yeah, I forgot what it was called. You want to go ahead, this is what we're using for the key ring. So you want to go ahead and take the wire and loop it around a cir like a circly shape three times because that's how a key ring looks. <laughs> and you just want to snip it off and you, if you want to, you can go ahead and try to make it look more like a key ring by making it look more circular. I kind of failed at that, but oh well. <laughs> Now you want to go ahead and ask a adult or someone that knows how to use an iron to go ahead and iron your little creation and then you want to go ahead and take an exacto knife and make one of the holes on one of the sides a little bit bigger so you can go ahead and thread your wire through and that's it. Now you just go ahead and put it onto your backpack and people are going to ask where to get this but you be like I made it. <laughs> Video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was really, really fun to make. And make sure you guys tell me which DIY was your favorite. Personally, I really like the ombre notebook and the little keychain. So, yeah. Thank you guys for subscribing. And I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.